Hello, Type Trust here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to blur an image just like this in Photoshop. So let's get right into it. First, we want to find an image where we want to blur the background. So I went on this website called Pixels. And let's see if we can find an image we want to use. And let's take this one as an example. The image is now opened in Photoshop and we are now ready to blur out the background. The first thing we want to do is to take a copy of our layer, just like this. And now we want to mask her out. Do that by going up in the selection tool right here and choose select subject. And if it load a bit, just like this. Now press on the select and mask and you will get this. Go down to the output right here and press on the selection and choose new layer with layer mask. When that's selected, just press OK. And as you can see, we have now created a new layer with the mask. Now we want to make this visible, so just press on this eye right here. And this just press this eye right here. And select this layer in the middle, just like this. Now we want to mask her out again. So just go up in the selection tool. You can use the lasso or the polygon. And you can also use the selection tool, just like this. But we want to get more of the background width as well. So just select the lasso tool and do this all the way around. Just like this. Now we want to use the content aware field to replace her with the background. Do that by going up in Edit and choose Fill. You can also use the keyboard shortcut Shift F5. And you will get this. And under the contents, choose Content Aware. And then press OK. And it will load again. This can take quite some time if you have a slow computer and just like this the background is now replaced and now you want to remove this selection by pressing the Control and D on your keyboard just like this so now on this layer we have the background and we have her cut out as a mask now it's time for us to blur out the background so do that by going up in filter and choose blur and Gaussian blur So you can now blur the background and let's say this looks good for now. Then just press OK. And as you can see the background is now blurred and we can make this layer visible again by clicking on this. And the image is now done and the background is blurred. This is how it looked before and this is how it looks now. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you got something out of today's video. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video and comment down below what we should do next. See you in the next one.